We are about to bust this 1989 score football pack and randomize the list. Whoop. Obviously, I'm going to grab the, the wrong. There we go. Whoop. I'm going to do it seven times. One, two, three. Card on top will be the number one card. Person on top of the randomizer. Four, five, and six. Good luck. Ronald P, you have the first and the last card. You know, I don't remember opening up 89 score football back in the day. I remember opening up um, 89 Pro Set. Like, I could buy that from the local Soda King, but they didn't sell score. So I'm just curious, like, where was score sold? And, like, why was it hard to get, if anyone knows the story? All right. So we got Jamie Holland. Card number one. Ronald P., you have the first five cards. Good luck. Former great, rest in peace, Jerome Brown. Thanks, Tom D. I appreciate it. Yeah, I was hoping it was going to break tonight, but, uh, you know, if we get live tomorrow for a few hours, we'll try. Uh, thanks for your support, and we'll catch you later, Tom. Have a great night. Ricky Jackson. Once again, Ronald P. First few cards are yours. I know folks that are completing PSA 10 uh, complete sets of this, which is pretty wild. It's a lot of cards, 300 cards. Billy Brooks was a good uh, receiver back in the day. I remember him. Well, the next card is yours, Reggie Langhorn. John Taylor, rookie, is next for you, Jonathan D. Yeah, these cards are pretty nice. Thanks, Stephen K. Have a great night, bud. Appreciate your support and watching. Hopefully, we'll see you soon. Ronnie Lott is card eight. Ronald P. These cards are just busting out here. Love it. Lorenzo Hay. Hey, I, I mean, I remember. I mean, I still watch football a lot, but I remember the set very well. Bernie. Co oh! Michael Irvin rookie coming up. That is for you, Ronald P. Spot 11. See if it's, uh, it's really nice. It's definitely a 9, possibly a 10. Congratulations. Hall of Fame rookie. Congratulations, Ron. Michael B. Christian Okoye. The Nigeria Nightmare. He was awesome, man. I loved him. Tim Brown is his rookie, but it's not, you know, his base rookie. It's uh, his record breaker. He was awesome, too. Really great set. John Montana record breaker, and then, you know, I never knew. Uh, hey, Robert, there's 15 cards in here? Yeah. You give me uh, 13 holders? It's all right. I'll grab two more. Joe Montana. And then was the Landry, uh, was the Landry card tough? This is really nice. I, mean, I don't know if you're supposed to grade these or not, but, like, I remember this was the last card in the set or something. It was, it's really nice. Chris, uh, BGS 986 Fleer? I can check it out for you. I'd have to look. I mean, I know what I think a nice 9 and PSA is worth, but BGS, I'd have to look up at vintage card prices. Uh, that's 89 score. Okay. Sure. I'll check it out for you in a few minutes, though, Chris, on VengeCardPrices.com. Yeah, remember, uh, is the Landry worth... Oh, did I send the, the email? See, I didn't. I didn't send it for the 89 score. Okay. Robert, what pack was that? 
25? Robert? So I'm just having a basketball, I'm going to do basketball, I'm going to score football. I'm about to eat Okay, great. Chris, I'll see if I can pull it up right here. Uh, I have VCP. Am I signed in? Let me see if I remember my... Yeah, the answer was pretty cool. I don't know if, uh, like, it's, you know, it's a gradable card. You know, meaning, like, it would pay for it to grade. But I'm looking up your 86 foot because I'm curious myself. Uh... No problem, Chris. I'm checking now. So, BGS9 with a 9.5. Is the 9.5 sub the centering or, you know, one is something different? Because I think that matters. Like, to me, I would rather have... It is... Michael, I didn't know. Oh, that's kind of cool. Sure. Just bear with my computer one sec. Oh, let me shut off the uh, local recording.